Okay. Good afternoon. Once again, it's Patrick right here. And I call Mr. Pong, Dumorin. Yeah. Today, we're going to talk about uh, our keyboards. Uh, most of the time, uh, they call me, Ah, Patrick, me come to a computer, I'm just not call English, you know. I feel yeah. Me boy wire, na go say. Me boy you are. They me boy be am ba. When you na I ngongo na I. We the person be the computer and crack on and call you misika. They are semi. It is no problem. Uh, the only problem is that um, when you buy a computer originally made French, you have to know that your keyboard is French. When you buy a computer originally made English, the keyboard is English. The way the English keyboard is, is not the same as that of the French. The M you see on the keyboard, on the French type of keyboard, is not the same or it's not at the same place as that of the English. So when you buy a computer originally made French and you change the system of exploitation, mainly talking mainly about, about Windows, when you change it into English, then you have to know that you have to change your keyboard software to suit the system of exploitation. So to do that, this is how you should go about it. You come to start right here and then the control panel, you just click in and you have this window right here. Windows 7, Windows Vista, Windows XP, they all work the same way. Just look for in your control panel, just look for time, language, and region. You click into it, you choose region, language. Then you have this window right here. When you come right here, you see clavier, which is in English, you say keyboard and language. You click in here and then you modify your keyboard to suit the, 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 your system of exploitation. When you see right here, because my PC is in French, French is already installed. Let's take it for instance that I change this system of exploitation into English, automatically find English just right here at this same session here, over here. You see English here. In, let's take it for instance, I change this system of exploitation into English, then you find English installed right here. So, since I've changed it into English, then I have to add the French keyboard to my English system of exploitation so that the keyboard will run according to the system of exploitation I have. Or if not, if you click on anything, it will not work the way you want it. So you just add it just right here. When you see this button, you click add and then you choose from the list over here since the PC was in French and I've changed it into English, then I have to look for the French keyboard and give it to the computer. So you come right here, you look for, for let's for instance, uh, French keyboard, and then you choose right here, and then you say add. So when you add it, you come, you come right here, and then you select it here so that it suits your computer. As soon as you add French, you say applique and then your keyboard you restart your computer and your keyboard will start working properly for you thank you very much for listening to another comes upon www.ghanainfrance.com www.gifradio.com thank you